what is up guys and welcome to part three of our business calculations practice test so we have this problem gm stock sells for 46 dollars and one quarter commission rate 2500 and above 0.9 percent plus 25 dollars what will a broker's fee be for the purchase of 100 shares of gm stock so 100 shares of gm stock would be worth 46.25 let me also underline this so 46.25 right 46 and one quarter times by 100, which is the number of shares that you're buying. Now this equals 4,625. Now on this $4,625, this does satisfy the requirement. It is over 200, it is over 2,500. So this is greater than 2,500. Um, so you're gonna earn this 0.9% um, uh, commission plus the $25. So you are earning, so we have plus 25, and 0.9% of 4,625 is 4625 times 0 0.009 is 41.625, 41.625. And now if we add 25 to that, we get 66.625, 66.625, and that rounds to $66.63. The next question is, Find the dealer cost when the list price is $103, with chain discounts of 12% and 10%. I encourage that you first try this problem on your own before I explain how to solve it. Okay, I'm going to assume that you had a go on this problem now, and here's how you would go about solving it. So the list price is $103. Let me do some color coding. Again, if you're not familiar with chain discounts, we do have a video uh, on this chain discounts. Uh, you can check that. If you're watching on our website, we have it on there, and we also have it on YouTube. Uh, so, with chain discounts of 12%, so if you're getting a 12% discount, it would retain 88% of the value, so that's times 0 0.88. And then you get another discount after this of 0, um, of 10%, so the retained value is 90%. So, your first 12% discount results in this, oh, sorry, oh, can't see colors correctly, I guess. Okay, 103 times 0 0.88, 103 times 0 0.88 is 90.64 and now i have to multiply this by 0 0.9 and that leads us to times 0 0.9 leads us to 81.576 which rounds to 81.58 now we'll go on to our last and final problem alicia works for commission she is paid 10 percent on the first $10,000 of sales, 15% on the next $5,000, and 20% on sales over $15,000. If she sold $18,500, how much did she earn? Uh, so for the first $10,000, she earned 10%. So if we have a total of $18,500, and on the first $10,000, first 10, we had a 10%. So she earned $1,000, 10% to $1,000. Now on the next 5,000, so now we're going from 10, so now we're at that 15,000 mark, right? Next 5,000, so now we're at the next 5,000. She earned 15%, so 15% of 5,000, because she's earning 15% on the 5,000 is 750. And lastly, 20% on sales over 15,000. So she had another $3,500, so we add 3,500, and that brings us to a total 18,500. And she earns 20% on this $3,500, which is equal to 3,500 times 0 0.2 is 700. If we add these three up, we get uh, 700 plus 750 plus 1,000. I could have done this in my head, $2,450. Thank you for watching. I hope you found this video helpful. Uh, yep, thank you and goodbye.